New report says nearly half the tap water in the U.S. tested positive for PFAS, those forever chemicals coming out of 45% of our drinking faucets. They are known to cause health problems, even cancer. WCCO's Jason Rantel explains why Minnesota scientists aren't surprised and what homeowners can do about it. A recent study by the U.S. Geological Survey found that at least 45% of the nation's tap water is estimated to contain PFAS. The USGS says it's the first time anyone has tested both public and private water on this broad a scale. The agency did its tests directly from kitchen sinks. The study tested for more than 700 locations, urban, rural, and everything in between, with most exposure found in urban areas and potential PFAS sites like landfills. According to their data, the Twin Cities area and southwest Wisconsin had some of the highest numbers of detections in the country. We know that close to that number, um, in that 45-50% range is uh, exactly what we have in Minnesota of public water supplies that have PFAS contamination at the sources. The good news is that um, very few systems actually are exceeding the current state standards for PFAS for drinking water. The state's own testing, which samples water sources, not taps, found PFAS in the state for the most part to be undetectable or at safe levels, with a few exceptions. Berman says 1% of Minnesota tested above state standards. There's still detection, obviously, in the uh, city water supplies, but by the time it gets to people, it's been treated. Is there a chance this could be a lot more dangerous than we thought originally? They're constantly looking at the research literature, both nationally and internationally, to make sure that we're not surprised. Still, Berman says the USGS study should continue to raise cause for concern. It's just another confirmation that whether you look at this on state by state or nationally, you, you continue to see this uh, huge uh, scale and magnitude of the problem. Jason Rantala, WCCO News. And there is some water treatment you can do at home. The health department says water filters containing active carbon or reverse osmosis membranes can be effective at removing PFAS from water supplies. For more information, you can head to this link uh, to this story on WCCO.com.